my wife Natalie was uh, she she had done some fishing before I met her. She was uh, she, a, a Hawaii state champion. She went out in a boat and landed a load of mahi mahi, won first prize in the in the ladies championship. Now I don't know if that, if that was something that she she did on a regular basis. I think she she was kind of press ganged into it. But being Canadian, she does have a appreciation of the outdoors, and she likes the same sort of things as I do, you know. Uh, and we spent a lot of time in Canada, fishing and traveling and hiking and all sorts of things, you know. Not just the fishing, it's about being outside, and she appreciates that. So if I want to go fishing up in the mountains or to the Caribbean, you know, she's, she's uh, more than happy to, to come along because it's, uh, she enjoys it as well, you know. She knows, she knows how to get my uh, attention. You know, if she says, uh, yeah, I want to go to this destination, I go, oh, all right. And then she says, she usually follows up with, there's some good fish in there, you know. Oh yeah, and then I get interested, you know. And uh, we've been to all sorts of weird and wonderful places like, you know, New Zealand, Australia, Tasmania, uh, Canada, all over Canada fishing, just driving, uh, sometimes on guided trips, and sometimes just off the cuff. Oh, there's a bit of water. Let's stop the car and go and explore it, you know. An adventure. I, I love an adventure. I still love an adventure, you know. The unknown is great. There's that element to fishing. We have, we had uh, a few, a few um, run-ins with bears in Canada. But you've got to expect that. I mean, that's, their, that's where they live, you know. And, uh, you know, in hindsight, we probably should have been a bit more careful when we literally ran into a bear, you know. Uh, a few times uh, in remote places there's always going to be a little danger whether it's in the Rocky Mountains where you've got bears uh, to uh, you know some places around London where you've got gangs and uh, uh, what have you you know I mean you can go I was, I was saying to someone you can go five minutes from here and go to a pond pay 10 quid and catch a 20 pound carp if you want to do that which is fine or you can go somewhere unknown, you don't know what the fish is there, you don't know what's what. And it's a real adventure, you know.